The Senate set to review the FBI report on Judge Kavanaugh this morning, but if Democrats don't find enough there to keep him off the Supreme Court, they already have their backup plan that he's too partisan for the job. Anyone who watched the Judiciary Committee hearing on Thursday should have serious, if not disqualifying, doubts about Judge Kavanaugh's credibility and independence. He revealed himself as a partisan. I would think that if I were a Democrat going before him, I'd ask him to recuse himself. But is this a hypocritical accusation from the Democrats? Let's ask Justin Walker. He has clerked for both Justice Kennedy and Judge Brett Kavanaugh. Thank you so much for being with us again. What do you think about this? First, it was the accusations of alleged sexual assault. Then it was he drinks too much beer. Then he was throwing ice when he was in college. Then it was his tone and his demeanor. And now he's too partisan? Well, to hear Senator Schumer talk about credibility, when it's the Democrats on the Judiciary Committee, one of them, for example, claimed to be a Vietnam veteran, totally made up that story. One of them, for example, stood by Senator Daniel Inouye when he was accused of 20 years of being a sexual predator. She didn't say one word against him at the time. And then we have Senator Feinstein, who was trusted by Dr. Ford to keep her name private. And then, just on the eve of Brett Kavanaugh's confirmation vote, Dr. Ford's name gets leaked to the press. If we're going to have an FBI investigation, I think one of the things we ought to be investigating is how Dr. Ford's name got leaked to the press against her will. She's been a victim of this unfair, vicious search and destroy mission against Judge Kavanaugh, whose only mission has been to delay for the sake of delay. What's the next line of attack from the Democrats that you expect? Oh, my goodness. You know, Angelie, there are limits to my imagination. <laughs> uh, I, 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 I don't know. What, what I do know is that on the other hand, what we've seen from Senator Mitch McConnell, I think, has been his finest hour. He has stood firm for Judge Kavanaugh. And the same has been true for, for President Trump. Mm -hmm. He has not cut and run when it would have been easy for a president to do so. Senator McConnell, Senator Graham, President Trump, uh, they have uh, not abandoned Judge Kavanaugh to the wolves. And uh, I think it's been their finest hour yeah. as a result. They said they're not going to be intimidated. Thank you so much for being with us. We appreciate it. Justin Walker, thank you.